So I'm making some linguine with Alfredo sauce on it. And it's going to be just a little spicy. Right now I'm going to start my sauce. So I have it on the medium heat. I'm just going to put in three quarters of a stick of salted butter. Then I have some half and half. This is a quarter, half and half. I don't know how much I'm going to put in until I start pouring it. Alright, so I put in about one pint, half of this, con this one quart container. So I'm just going to let the butter melt right now and then I'm going to start putting my cheeses in. And the cheeses I'm using, I'm using about a third of a cup of sharp cheddar. I'm using some Mexican style blend shredded cheese. It's natural cheese, a blend of Monterey Jack mild cheddar, asadero, and queso quesadilla cheeses. And I have some shredded parmesan I'm going to add to it. Okay, so now when it's just about boiling, you turn the heat down to low. Turn the heat down to low after it starts boiling. And you start adding your cheeses. I'm gonna wait until this cheese melts to add the Parmesan. And you make sure you stir it so it won't fall to the bottom and stick. Now you just have that one a medium low heat and let it melt. I have it closer to low than medium. So now that it's melting and bubbling, I'm going to add the seasoning. Just going to put a little garlic powder. seasoning salt a little pepper and mix it Now I have some shaved Parmesan cheese. And I'm just going to put half of it in there to melt of what I have. Uh, just a handful. And save some just in case you want to put some on top. And mix that in. See how thick and nice and... Oh, it looks so good. Now I'm just going to let the rest of that melt while I cook my pasta. On a low heat, remember. I'm just going to put this linguine in a pot of boiling water with a little olive oil and some salt.
cleaned the, the linguine. And now I'm just going to pour the cheese sauce over it. Nice cheesy linguine. Serve it up in a bowl or a plate with anything you like. You could you you could have it with steak, chicken, meatballs, whatever your heart desires. I thank you so much for coming through to watch this video. And I hope you enjoyed it and I hope you try this really easy recipe. Please give this video a thumbs up because it helps the video to be seen and recommended by YouTube. And don't forget to subscribe. Love y'all. See you next time. Mwah, mwah.